I'm going to show you how to how to create a simple program. This program will allow you to convert yards into feet. It's pretty simple, pretty basic, but it's a pretty good practice for someone starting up C++. The program I'm using here is Microsoft Visual Studio 2008. This is possible with other C++ programs as well, including older versions of Visual Studio. Well, we want to start a new project and we will select Win32 console application. Let's name it feet to yard or actually yard to feet. Go to application settings and select empty project and click finish. Once that's done you can go into projects and add a new item. Uh, you should add the CPP file, the C++ file put in a name for it. We'll go with yard to feet again. You get a blank file like this here. You should start off with marking your your program first. Programmer. You can enter your name, I'll enter mine, which is Nasmus. Program, name of the program, I'll call it yard to feet conversion. You have to start off with a simple command line. This looks something like this. Include IO stream. These are just some basics. You can do int main or even void main for the next one. I'm doing void main right here. Don't put a semicolon here. It will give you an error later on. You open uh, bracket. These are the curved brackets, not the regular brackets. You should close it immediately just in case you forget later on because it will give you an error. The first thing you should do is declare your variables. I'm going to use integers which is int and I'm going to call them yard and feet. Separate them with comma and end it with a semicolon. We'll have an output first. I'll ask the user to input the number of yards for example. I'll say please input number of yards semicolon to end the line. See in is the input. This is where they will enter the number of yards. It can be 5, 10, whatever they choose. And then comes the actual formula. Uh, we know that there are three feet into every yard, so we'll do feet equals yard times three. We have the value of the yard already, which is which comes from the C in. If you put in five, it'll be five times three, and we'll get the feet. So you want to output it again. C out. We'll say yard. This yard will be shown whatever the input was. You have to cascade it again. Yards equal to cascade it feet. This value will be whatever this value is. Cascade it again. Feet. E N D L is the end line. It'll end the line. Otherwise, whatever happens next will be on the same line can get ugly. System pause pauses the system after it's done. Otherwise it'll close immediately. The program I mean. Uh, make sure that you have a semicolon on at the end of every line. At the end. Except for the void main. This command is ended by this bracket down here. It's a simple program you can then debug it. You can start debugging, you can click F5 on your keyboard and it will do the same thing. Uh, no errors. Let's say 5 yards. You get 15 feet. If you want to test it again, you run it again. Let's say 10 yards. It's 30 feet. That sounds about right. Well, thanks for watching the video. I know this is a basic program. I will try to put more complicated ones later on. Enjoy it. I hope you enjoyed it.